you can vote. Jump on the community tab here on the Flyride channel and you can vote for people that you see there listed. You'll have a link to their Instagram account. You can check out their car, see what they drive. I'll put the option in your hand. And as we get down to our finalists, we're gonna have five finalists. You will vote for who the winner is and then we're gonna vote for what cool stuff we put in those headlights. It's gonna be what you wanna see specifically. It's gonna be your decision, not mine. <laughs> Hey, what's up? I'm Chris and you are back at Flyride where you're gonna learn more about the what, how, and why of custom automotive lighting. Now I'm finally gonna give you the full breakdown on the contest that I have running right now. Now that contest won't actually have a winner until we reach 20K. Before we get into the contest details, I do wanna cover a couple things. Man, the outpour of support that I've got lately has just been crazy. You guys are awesome. Now granted, I know that you wanna win a custom set of headlights built by myself. I get that. That makes sense, you know, you want cool stuff. We'll film it, we'll document it, we'll show everybody else how to do it. But the stuff you guys have been saying is just, it's cool. It's really, it feels like the effort this far to get to where I'm at on the YouTube channel has actually been a really big benefit to myself and more importantly to you. The response that I get from you is so positive. It's just made it super clear to me. That's what this video is gonna be about. Let's talk about some changes and some things that I really need your help with and why I need that help. So the first thing you may have noticed is that I've been on the road a bunch and I am changing things up to where I can travel down to San Diego, work with the guys from Throttle, work with TJ and Calvin and Dustin and just kind of have them around the channel a lot more often. And we're gonna be doing projects with you, I really, really wanna take a lot more time in the future to connect with other companies, other YouTubers, and you. I really do wanna invite you to be part of the channel and engage a whole lot more. And that's a lot about why this contest is happening right now, so that I'm listening, so that I can pay attention and have a pulse on what matters to you most. And so, you're gonna have a lot of voting options on the future content coming up. Now, the only way I'm gonna be able to pull that off is if I get help with editing. I spend way Way too many hours editing. I care about all sorts of stuff like the music and the transitions and the little things that literally just get in the way of the content. So I'm gonna pass that role off to somebody new. Actually the video that just got about 11,000 views a couple days ago for the RX-8, that was put together by my boy Vincent. So thank you Vincent, you're doing a great job. I look forward to seeing a lot more of the impact of your work on the channel here. And so you guys that are watching, you specifically, I need help so that I can continue to grow the channel and not wreck my personal situation here with Flyride. It's very, very tight, not like perfectly managed. It's like the money is very tight in order to keep this thing going. If this contest goes well, I wanna keep them coming. Like every 5,000 or 10,000 subscribers, I wanna do another one. But right now at 20K, I think it's the best time to really do this and launch this thing off. And so at the same time as I make contests available, I'm gonna open the door and ask for help. And this isn't for everybody. This is just for people that wanna do something Thing or get more involved with Flyride and get maybe some behind the scenes access or more direct access to myself, I'm actually gonna open up a Patreon. And don't hate me, because listen, some people get attacked specifically around automotive when they do anything with Patreon. And this is what I understand. People don't wanna be taken advantage of. They don't wanna feel like somebody's asking for their money for nothing. But I'm gonna tell you this from my perspective. I'm putting these videos out there and it hurts. It literally takes away the income. I only make about 40 grand a year running Flyride. That means that I'm working 60 to 80 hour weeks every week, year after year, and when you really break it all down of what my income is, it's like less than minimum wage. It's pretty ruthless, and that's what it takes to run a business and grow something from the ground up yourself. So I'm not taking away from that, I'm not crying. Now coming up, I have some parts that just got finished in manufacturing. They're gonna come in for the Nissan GTR, and I'm gonna be spending almost all my time building GTR lights. That's why I can't take your custom jobs. A lot of you have asked me, will you build this for me? Will you build that for me? You guys are awesome for asking because if I chose to do nothing but builds, I could take a lot of custom work on right now and I would make a whole lot more money, right? The problem is that only helps you, the guy that pays for it, and me, and I really want to help the whole channel. I wanna help tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands or 
one day a million people on this channel. That would be amazing to get to reach that many people. And for those that really wanna take it a step further, I'm going to give certain access in Patreon and those that are just trying to go off on it and make this a big side hustle for themselves, make some cool income with it, that's why we have the Lightsman Academy. And so that's gonna be opened up to everybody as well. And Vincent, my editor, is the key player in that because I've had six months to get that course 100% dialed and it's still not. I'm trying to make YouTube content. I'm trying to run Flyride. I had to train Kristen to come in. Jack left the company. All sorts of stuff has been wild. And we moved for the third time in two years. That is crazy. So let's just wrap all this up into one nice little bow and say it's contest time. Let's talk about details. So many of you asked how do I get involved in the contest? And what you didn't know is that by asking that question, you just became involved in the contest. And how you did that was you commented, you engaged with the content. So I got a lot of videos on YouTube. There's a lot of information out there. There's not a lot of comments. When YouTube looks at what I'm putting out and they don't see a lot of comments and they don't see a bunch of likes or engagement back and forth, they're like, eh, Nobody really cares about this. But you guys tell me otherwise, and I know that because in the hundreds of comments on that last video, you were telling me all sorts of stuff. You tell me in emails, you tell me in DMs, you call. I hear it all over the place and it feels great. But YouTube doesn't know. This is what the plan is for this contest. It's to show Instagram and YouTube that you guys care. And if you don't, we're gonna find out because there's not gonna be anything that changes on YouTube or Instagram. But I really don't believe that's the case. You engaging and asking the questions and getting replies. I'm gonna reply to all the stuff that you guys are asking and that's a big commitment of my time to jump in and just spend hours answering all these questions. And this is gonna be the rules for the whole contest. I don't want you to jump in and just randomly comment on a video that you don't care about because that's just wasting everybody's time and I think it's almost like cheating. Like, I don't want that. But if there's anything that helps you, put a comment in there. Let me know that that was helpful. If there's something that wasn't answered, put a question in there. Let me know what I could do to further explain it specifically to you because I'll reply in that question that you post up on that YouTube video. Same thing for Instagram. So those are the first two things that you need to do. Comment and post on YouTube videos, comment and post on Instagram posts, same thing. If you like one of the guy's cars, cool, post about it. Here's the third thing. If you have purchased anything from Flyride, some bulbs or some products, or even if you didn't purchase from me, but you went out and you bought yourself a part from the Retrofit Source or Diode Dynamics or somebody like that, and you used it and you installed it and you had any inspiration by this channel, just tag me in the posts on Instagram and I wanna repost those on the Flyride Instagram so that I can show anybody else that's interested in this that they can do it. They can totally take the information that I'm putting out, learn from it, go out there and build some cool stuff themselves. That's really what I wanna see happen. I want this to be value driven for the people that are watching, for you that's watching right now. And the last thing that you can do to earn some points in my book is share this video right here on Facebook. Let people know that you're trying to win some lights, that you're learning something from this channel because if you are, that's the message that I want you to put out there. If you're not, Save your time because I don't want to see a whole bunch of spam going through here that doesn't help anybody. The numbers don't matter. I mean, I, I really want that to be clear. The amount of subscribers don't matter. The amount of people following on Instagram, they don't matter, they don't change anything. A lot of people are stupid and they go buy that stuff. Like, I don't get it. <laughs> Gary Vaynerchuk always talks about that and he's like, uh, we know what you're doing, like we get it. You have nine million followers and like nine people liked your video on Instagram. Like. That's kind of silly, right? I don't want vanity metrics, I don't care. I want to know that the content is actually working, that it's actually valuable, that people are doing something with it. That's why I want these contests to continue if this one goes well. So if you don't win on this one, your being involved in it is gonna be a win in itself because that's gonna mean more of these things happen continuously down the road as we hit more and more milestones with the channel and with the progress on Patreon and on the online course and all that, I really wanna just dump it back into this and make more opportunity for you. Here's how you are actually going to win. I'm gonna look at all the engagement that's happening on YouTube, on Instagram. One guy told me, I don't have Instagram. I was like, well, it doesn't look like you're gonna win. I mean, seriously, if you wanna get any shot at this, take some action, go find the things that are valuable to you or that you think would be valuable to people that watch your Instagram, that you think, I don't know, my boy's got a BRZ and 
Chris just showed him how to tear apart a BRZ headlight like we're gonna do for Dustin coming up here in a minute. And I want that to be helpful to somebody, not just showing off, hey guys, I can take apart a BRZ headlight. Like we know that I can do that, right? Bragging does nothing for anybody. I want to teach cool stuff to people who would otherwise be just a little bit too timid to take action. So share this stuff out and I'm gonna be monitoring who's out there pushing, who's hustling this content and showing, I don't know, other people that it matters to them. Does that make sense? <laughs> like literally a comment to this video would be, this makes sense, you get it. We wanna show YouTube and Instagram that the content that we're pumping out there is valuable and that more people should watch it. Because what happens is they will take that engagement and they'll say, yo, these people care. Let's put this in front of more people and they'll start suggesting it. And when it's suggested, that's when you get these big spikes in viewership and engagement and things start to really pop. Clearly that's what I wanna happen here. I want this to be a full-time gig for myself and right now it costs me hundreds or thousands of dollars every month just to be able to keep doing it. It doesn't really make me anything. The money that YouTube pays me is a drop in the bucket to what I'm putting out to make this happen. I wanna see that flip-flop to where I'm able to actually do this and make enough money to continue to do it to the point that it really replaces all of the other work that I've been offering. And at that point, I can really just focus on making sure that there's more amazing builders out there, more amazing products to highlight, just showing people all the cool stuff that I've got to be part of for the last 15 years building Flyride and how you can do the same exact thing for yourself. <laughs> I will go forever and I think that's the point. I've got Vincent now. I can go forever. I shot five videos yesterday in San Diego. Five of them. Those are all coming up. I want this to start becoming a daily thing and the only way I can do that is with your help. So I want you to win. Here's how voting is gonna work. I'm gonna see who's commenting and actually contributing and pushing this whole Fly Ride Fam thing forward. Put them in a little bin over here and be like, hey, what do you guys think about these guys? And you can vote. Jump on the community tab here on the Fly Ride channel and you can vote for people that you see there listed. You'll have a link to their Instagram account. You can check out their car, see what they drive. I'll put the option in your hand and as we get down to our finalists, we're gonna have five finalists. You will vote for who the winner is, and then we're gonna vote for what cool stuff we put in those headlights. It's gonna be what you wanna see specifically. So I need your help, not only in engaging with the content now, but also in helping me pick the winner. It's gonna be your decision, not mine. I'm just gonna pick some guys that I'm impressed by, and let me tell you, some of you guys are impressing me already. I'm stoked to see that people are getting it. Maybe kind of understanding what this contest was about before seeing this video. So good for you guys, you're sharp people. I love that I get to engage and just talk with you guys, that you're sending me all these DMs and emails and calls and all that. So I'm gonna wrap it up with that. You guys know what to do. Go out there, make it happen. I appreciate it. I appreciate all the awesome comments. I mean, if I wasn't so long-winded, I would read you some of the comments, which I will do in a future upcoming video. It was just awesome. Some of the stuff people were telling me, a lot of it had to do with like taking care of my family and not missing all of the most important parts of this life that I'm living right now. And it's not about business. It was very much more about family. And that was the coolest thing ever. So thank you if you commented anything, if you've been keeping up with my Instagram stories and all of that, commenting the stuff that happened with my wife. She just had surgery on her hand. She's out of commission. I'm at home with the boys and I'm trying to make this content happen all at the same time. You are making that happen. You're the inspiration for me to continue to do that. So thank you so much. I can't thank you possibly enough. So let's keep it rolling. I can't wait to see who wins this contest. And it's gonna happen in a couple days, so. Let's make it happen, guys. I'll see you next time.